Hello my friends and welcome to my bathroom. That's right, it might be a little bit echoey in here, but we are trying something completely different today. Recently you guys have expressed an interest in knowing a little bit more about things I do outside of weight loss and Weight Watchers and I track bites and food, which is fantastic because there is so much more to me than just those things. One of the things that you guys were really interested in was beauty and skincare. And so today I'm bringing you my winter skincare routine as of right now. My skincare routine in the morning is super, super simple because I don't like to, I, I like to keep the exciting stuff for nighttime when I'm actually going to be sleeping rather than when I'm going to be putting makeup on my face. Today happens to not be a day I plan on putting makeup on my face, but either way, I like to keep it simple in the morning. So step one is I don't actually wash my face. I just got out of the shower, hair is up. Today was not even a hair washing day for me. Clean clothes are on, but I didn't wash my face. I just splashed it with a little bit of water because I don't wanna over dry. One of the things I'm noticing about my skin is ever since I started using Curology, hang on, that's sitting right here. Ever since I started using Curology, hashtag not sponsored, my friends, my acne has cleared up tremendously. I don't know if you can tell, like there's still a couple of little things hanging out here, but compared to what it was, my skin is on point. But what this has done is dry out my skin pretty significantly. I went from having to use oil-free products and avoiding dewy skin and, and hydrating and all that jazz because of my acneic skin. And now I thrive off of a hydrating, anti-aging skincare regimen paired with Curology in the evening. So that's a little bit of background about my skin. Also, it is winter in Minnesota, which means I'm real dry. Some days are better than others, but I can feel, I can feel the dryness in my skin today. And like I said, I didn't even wash my face this morning. So it's really, really intense. So I'm gonna show you what I do every day in the morning for my skincare routine. I usually start with a mist or a toner of some kind. And I recently found this in my stash. I have quite the stash. This is Grace and Stella Spray All Day Hydrating Rose Facial Mist. And this I got actually in a FabFit Fun Box. And let's spray it. Give myself good and, good and damp there. Woo, if you do not like the scent of rose, you will not like this because it really smells like rose. And quite frankly, I normally don't, like I don't gravitate towards rose scented things. I love the flowers, but I don't love rose scented things, but there's something about this that's, it's very calming. It's very calming and I really enjoy that. So that's just to dampen my skin up a little bit and offer a little bit more hydration. Then I use a vitamin C serum in the morning and I'm currently bouncing between two. I have just gotten on the vitamin C serum bandwagon and so to start off with, I got this one. This is 20% C and E and ferulic acid serum from Timeless Skincare. Timeless Skincare is very inexpensive, but really good quality skincare. This is very, I mean, they're both very liquidy, I guess, but this is very, very watery, but very, very good. I'm using this one today, however, this one is higher end. This is by Biosance, which is a very expensive, high-end skincare brand, but it is such good quality. Like. I'm learning in my ripe old age of 33 that I need to invest in my skincare because I if, like makeup is nice and everything like that, but if your skin isn't in good condition, what good is the makeup? You know what I'm saying? I wanna look good with and without makeup on. So what I'm putting on now is their squalene and vitamin C serum. So squalene is incredibly hydrating and it is a, it's something that has to do with like mimics the natural oil barrier that's already in our skin or something like that. I'm not a skincare expert, I'm just a skincare junkie. And it's very, very hydrating. So while the Timeless one was more watery, this is an oil. And it feels so good and hydrating and got vitamin C in there. So now I just let that sink in for a hot second while I do my eye cream. My daytime eye cream is the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye. I have become a huge fan of It Cosmetics lately and their products are just fantastic. They're wonderful. Now, I use my middle finger, even though you're supposed to use your ring finger, because I do not have any strength in my ring finger to speak of. Long story, if you know the story, great. If not, I'll post a video that tells you about the story. But the bottom line is I put a generous amount of eye cream underneath my eyes because 
your girl has got some dark circles that are a force to be reckoned with. And now, while I let the oil, the serum, whatever you want to call it, and the eye cream sink in, I brush my teeth. All right, now that that's all done, all I have left to do is my moisturizer, and my morning moisturizer is also an IT Cosmetics products. It is IT Cosmetics Secret Sauce. I ended up getting this in a kit that's probably no longer available, but this is an anti-aging, all-around epic sauce. What does it say? Clinically Advanced Miraculous Anti-Aging Moisturizer. And because I'm 33, anti-aging is not a bad idea for me. I've got some lines up in here. I've got some lines under my eyes that I really don't know what to do with. I tell you what. But I take, on days that I am not wearing makeup, I will put more on than on the days that I don't. Or that I do, rather. <laughs> because... When I've got all day to let this sink in, I want to make sure I'm super hydrated because, again, my skin is very, very dry because of the winter here in Minnesota. So I rub this in for a hot minute, make sure it gets all up in there, do the upward strokes like you were taught to do. You know, does that really make a difference? I have no idea. But, I, you know, I do mostly up, a little down get all the areas. This is what's been dry today, and this actually feels really good. All right, fantastic. And now, the icing on top of the super bougie skincare cake, that was really hard to say, is this. I am the proud owner of a jade roller. I got this in my FabFitFun box as well, and a lot of skincare people rave about the joys of jade rolling. Do I actually know what this is supposed to do for my skin? No. Does it feel good? Yes, and that is all that matters to me. So what I do is I just roll out a couple of times on every section of my skin, because I guess I heard you're not supposed to go back and forth like this, which I'm not entirely sure why. Supposedly it pulls on your skin and the whole goal of this anti-aging movement is obviously to prevent wrinkles and all that jazz. So I don't know if it's fact or not, but I listen to what the professionals say and I push out and what I think this does, outside of just feeling really nice because the jade stays cool unless you've been using it, like by the time I get to my forehead, the jade has warmed up a little bit, but actually it's still pretty cool. So this, this device, the stone, stays very cool, which is just nice and refreshing on your face, quite frankly. And I think it also ends up like mushing in my serums and moisturizers a little bit more, which couldn't hurt. So you have the little side that I use for the under eye. I try and push things away. Again, no idea if this is doing anything, anything at all, but it feels good. So we go with it, right? A little bit over there, a little bit over there. A little emphasis on my big old wrinkle that's right in the middle of my eyebrows. And boom, that's it, plain and simple. Quick, easy, and painless. I will have all the products that I use listed down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up to let me know that this kind of stuff is stuff you're interested in seeing. And if you have anything else that you might be interested in seeing, drop me a suggestion over in the comments down below so I know what you want to see next. Thanks for taking the time, take care, and I'll see you next time.